Zachary came home with a plan to make herbed mashed potatoes from potatoes purchased in bulk from Costco. He made the delicious potatoes that evening and had a great time with his family. A week later, the Hasselback potatoes he had bought at Costco had a weird, sweet taste and unpleasant, mushy texture. Zachary completely messed up the dish to the point of being so upset that his eyes were red with anger. We store most of our ingredients in refrigerators, but refrigerators can shorten the life of food. Zachary shouldn't have put potatoes in the fridge. When the potatoes are stored in the fridge, the starch turns into sugar, and the sweetness begins, and the hard potatoes become soft. In addition to potatoes, I will tell you what other ingredients should not be stored in the refrigerator. Number one, onions. When onions are stored in the refrigerator, they become easily squeezed due to moisture, prone to mold formation. Onions should be kept in a dry and cool place without peeling. The leftover onions should be vacuum packed and placed in the refrigerator. Number two, tomatoes. When tomatoes are stored in the refrigerator, they stop ripening. The cell membranes of the skin are damaged, resulting in poor freshness. It also reduces antioxidant properties. Store tomatoes at room temperature. Number three, potatoes. Zachary should have put the potatoes in a cardboard box to block the light and store them in room temperature. And if you put the potatoes next to the onion, they will both spoil more quickly. Number four, mayonnaise. When mayonnaise is stored in the refrigerator, the oil separates from the other ingredients, causing lumps therefore allowing bacteria to grow rapidly. Mayonnaise must always be kept cool at a cool room temperature. Number five, honey. Honey can be stored at room temperature for life. If you want candy made from honey, a refrigerator is for you. Run to the refrigerator now and get any onions, tomatoes, potatoes, mayonnaise, or honey out right away.